Mmm, this looks good. Oh, hi guys. Um, I'm messaging you guys today because I don't know if you guys heard about, but Newfoundland government is actually implementing a 20 cent increase to your favorite sugar drinks. So for you guys enjoying a Big Mary, along with Newfoundland's famous pineapple crush flavor, then you guys got another thing coming for you as of April 1st, 2022. Now, according to McLean.ca, as for many living in rural areas, pop consumption is more than a matter of regional pride, such as the case for Garland Keats. Each week, the 48-year-old guzzles six cases and several two-liter bottles of Coca-Cola in place of water. And come April 2022, Keats' source of hydration will be 20 cents more per liter under Newfoundland's new sugar sweetened beverage tax. The lovely, widely known as soda tax, is an attempt to limit the strain of chronic illnesses put on the healthcare system. The government said in its 2021 and 2022 budget, though it won't release specifications on how money from the tax will be spent until fall, nor is it known whether beverages containing artificial sweeteners will be taxed too. Here's a clip also from the government website. And for those who are also into cigarettes, a three cent increase per cigarette and six cent per gram increase for fine cut tobacco, the rebate for Labrador border zones will increase by three cents for cigarettes and six cents per gram for fine cut tobacco. There you have it guys. So whether you're having a Big Mary along with a Pitsin, Having down your favorite drink, be prepared to swallow that 20 cents per liter as of next year. As always, keep on gaming, have fun, peace out everyone.